Hi everyone, it's Natalie. So, um, I wanted to go ahead and do a video and show you today um, how I contour my, te my cheeks and do my blush. I've been trying to film an um, eyeshadow tutorial for you today, but um, apparently I need to rehearse that, I guess, because that kind of failed. So, just keep checking. I will get one up soon. I just, yeah, I guess have to practice because it was harder than I thought. So, I'm going to go ahead and show you how to do that. So, first off, I'm going to be using the NYC Sunny, this one right here. And we're going to use that to contour our cheeks. Um, this just works for me. It may not work for all skin types. But um, as you can see, I'm very pale, very white, ghostly pale. So this works for me. Um, yeah, we're just you just want to make sure you use something um, matte and with like a brownish color to it. And it's darker than your skin tone. So I'm going to take this brush right here. Looks like this. This is the Elf. Brush that is gone. Okay. It says the Elf Professional Bronzing Brush. So it's angled, goes up like this. But this is a smaller type brush as compared to, you know, something like this. This is a small one. So this one, um, I bought it at Target for a dollar, so it's pretty good. So we're going to take some, and we're going to go right here on the hollows of your cheeks. The hollows of your cheeks you can find if you do the fish face. <laughs> right there or also um, just you can fill up here your cheekbone and then your jaw is going to be in between that where there is no bone you press in right there so it's right here so we're just going to put it right there just go back and forth lightly you don't want to put a whole bunch of product on but you can always layer it so you can see it's like that. I'm going to do the other side. Just go back and forth. We're not going all the way down to where our mouth is. We're kind of just going in the center right here and stopping. Also, it's um, if you look down from this is where my the end of my eye is, straight down. We're stopping right there. So kind of make sure that you have them similar. They go in about the same. And then take a little bit more. And then we're going to darken it. So right here in the outer part, let's go back and forth. And do the same on the other side. Just right on the edge right there. Back and forth. I'm like shaking my old table. Okay. Now we're going to take um, just uh, some kind of brush, blush, <laughs> blush, brush. And this is one I have. I don't know what brand this is. It came with one of those makeup kits you get for Christmas. So, just a fluffy brush. And we're going to take the sunny bronzing color again. Put some on there. And just go right here. So just go out like that and then I'm um, gonna blend it back and then do the same thing on the other side make sure you're going right here so it's right behind the apples of your cheeks this is the apple right here if you smile right here and then get it and blend it back sure they're about the same then just kind of take your brush so don't dip in the powder again just blend it up a little bit so it already does have some powder you just want a tiny bit to go up like that so that when someone's looking at you face on you're gonna see it contoured right here and then it kind of go up so not a whole lot just a t tad of color right there yeah, make sure they're about the same. So now I'm going to take um, the Elf's Studio Blush. This one is in Tickle Pink. This is the only one I have right now. But just any kind of light colored blush. Um, this one is pretty pigmented, but I'm just going to use a tiny, tiny bit. So you just want to take a light colored blush. The one on your skin tone gives you 
a tad of color, but not too much. Um, another blush that you could use. Just, yeah, any really light one. You don't want anything too dark. So, like, this is one of the CoverGirls, like, cheekers, you know, maybe take, like, something like that, or even that one right there. Just a tiny, tiny bit of it. So I'm going to go and take it. This is my brush. Make sure you kind of dust it off the sunny. Just put it in there. Get it. I'll blow it real quick. Like that to get the excess off. And then put it right there. So it just kind of gives me a little bit of color, but not too much. Just a tad of pink right here. Then you're going to do the same thing on the other side. A little bit of color. I don't want it really light. Okay. And then I'm going to take another color. Um, this one is just from the 99 cent store. Aziza. Like this. But these actually work, so hey, why not, right? And I'm going to take the dark rosy brush. Blush. So, just any kind of darker rosy color. Go and put my brush in that again. And we're just going to put it right here on the upper um, cheekbone. And do the same to the other side. Okay, and I'm going to darken it a little bit. But yeah, I just like to go back and forth. That way, it um, helps keep it more even. And um, except for the blush, if you go down maybe a little bit too far just to help emphasize where you contoured your cheeks, maybe take like um, a really fluffy brush, put some of your powder on it, your setting powder, and just go right under to kind of redefine that line where you contour. Okay, and yeah, just put it wherever. And then last step, just put some lipstick or gloss or something. We use Classy, my e.l.f. lipstick. Let's put it on. I do my cheeks. I just change it up sometimes with the blushes I use, but that's it for the most part. So if you have any questions or comments or anything else, go ahead and leave them down below. And please subscribe and give this video a thumbs up if you liked it. Alright, thanks.